One very handy feature on CSNACs is the average return by month feature. You can see just by clicking on a commodity or an instrument what the return of that instrument is by month. So here, for example, in platinum, we can see that January and February tends to be very strong for platinum, whereas August and September tend to be comparatively weaker months. Similarly, if we just say clicked on gold, we see instantly, look, that over the last 35 years, the start of the year, January, February, tends to be very strong for gold, as well as the summer months in July, August. So using this average return by month feature means you can very quickly see the overarching and the big themes that are impacting different currencies and commodities and equity markets on a month by month basis. And that can be very helpful for your top down analysis.